and the bot attacks keep on coming. Hey guys, my name is Shabir from Velocity, and you guessed it, we're talking about bot attacks once again. Yofi is the latest Hololive talent to be terminated for the exact same bot attack method as what previously caught Kobo and a number of other VTubers. You can watch our videos on these events in the description. According to responses to Yofi's tweet asking for evidence of the attack, we can confirm that it was the same MO as the recent bot attacks. Accounts with vulgar profile pictures and name spamming obscene comments which then led to mass reporting. The screenshot does also appear to show that Yofi did indeed have chat visible on screen with profile pictures, so this may have been the trigger. As mentioned in our previous videos covering the issue, it looks like the best way to defend yourself is to not show live chat on screen or to at least remove profile pictures in the chat box. But it doesn't stop there. Kano Sukoya from Niji Sanji has also been hit with the ban hammer for what appears to be the same reason. These targeted attacks on VTubers have many feeling uneasy and understandably so. Rainy is just one of the many VTubers that are contemplating switching over to Twitch due to these attacks and the fear is honestly totally justified. Remember Zenon from Vtopia? We discussed how he was one of the first to get hit by these attacks way back on the 5th of May in our first video and he still has yet to get his channel back. And it's not just VTubers that are getting banned. Dedicated Hollow ID translator and friend Minyak Sayur has just had his channel taken down too and is in the process of appealing. You can rest assured that Cover and any color staff will be throwing everything they've got at YouTube to get their talents reinstated. But smaller VTubers, regardless of whether they're corporate or indie, they just don't have the resources for this. YouTube has been absolutely radio silent on the issue so creators are feeling lost and confused. We can only hope that they're working hard behind the scenes and will come out in full force soon with a fix that's hopefully more than just a band-aid for a bullet hole. Apologies once again for the negative news update, we just feel like we need to do our part to spread awareness and help protect our fellow creators at least until YouTube addresses the issue. Thanks again for watching guys, be sure to subscribe for updates on the issue and other VTuber content. This is Shabir from Velocity and I'll catch you on stream. Peace!